and we used to meet weekly in one of the rooms in the engineering block and have lunch together. We just bought fruit and bread and stuff and shared it basically informally and sort of planned our programme there. I'm not really sure that we had very much programme apart from that, the lunches and going to the rallies and then the University of London Club uh, uh, meetings were less frequent. We went to the Dutch Witten in 1975. Yeah. We to be, I think we spent quite a lot of time on site but there was a a uh, jamboree or something quite nearby as well and one day quite a large group went and visited there. It's mainly the sort of on-site activities of being with the patrol and sort of in an international group working together this way really was I remember and sort of preparing Dutch meals. <laughs> well I mean the Witan I think would certainly be one of the highlights of, and that you know that's the event as the whole really. Um, I remember doing a treasure hunt type event round Hull once to rally. I think because I'd never visited Hull before and it was quite interesting to visit a new place in that way. And of course Kayleys, we were quite into folk dancing. We were members of the folk dance club as well and so we enjoyed the Kayleys at the events. And I must say it's always nice to go to Kayleys where people actually join in <laughs> instead of having to be persuaded to join in, which I think still happens at Sago. Well, I think it's amazing that it's kept going for 50 years so much on the same lines and there's still so much enthusiasm and you know, rallies seem to be even better attended than they used to be. <laughs>